In this Canva tutorial, let's take a quick look at our PDF download options. So I have a sample planner opened up here and it's several pages, almost 50 or more. And you can see it's just different pages with different designs on each page. Pretty much looks like a planner. So if I wanted to download this as a PDF, I would go up to the share button in the upper right and go to download. From here, under file type, I can select two different types of PDF. PDF standard, which is best for just standard documents or emailing. And then if you're actually going to be printing this, you would go with PDF print. A PDF print is going to give you a higher resolution PDF file. That's why it's best for printing. If we do click on PDF print, we can include crop marks and bleed. We can flatten the PDF, which gets rid of any layering. We could also include notes if we want to. We can select specific pages that we want to include. So if you don't want the entire document, you could just export a single page or multiple pages. We can also select the color profile. Now this is where Canva Pro comes in. You need Canva Pro for CMYK printing, which is the best for professional printing. Although to be honest, you can convert it later uh, from RGB to CMYK. However, a lot of printers want CMYK, but honestly, you're gonna be fine if you just export with RGB, which is usually best for digital use. Then you can save your download settings if you do this a lot and you don't wanna change these very often and you would hit download. And let's take a quick look at the PDF standard options. The first difference here is you can't include the bleed or the crop marks because this isn't really for printing. So I wouldn't do this one for printing. So since those are print only options, I wouldn't use that anyway. You can still flatten the PDF, which will help reduce the file size and then select the pages. So this PDF will reduce the size of images and keep it down a little bit lower because the DPI will be a little bit lower. However, you have those two options between PDF standard and PDF print and then you would simply hit the download button and it will download to your downloads folder and you'll have a PDF with all the pages in it as well. And that's how you can download a PDF from Canva.